at big tournaments and early on in bracket as well. So here we go, Inkling versus Samus. Honeyo versus Rambles, game one, Hollow Bastion, okay? And we've had a lot of up-tempo games mm -hmm. in this block. This one is going to be a lot slower and a lot more methodical because <laughs> Samus has a lot of maneuverability, a lot more than you would perhaps anticipate from a zoning character. And Inkling, obviously, one of the more notorious, slippy, hard to get a grasp on characters. Mm. Where Honeyo, what she's going to want to do here is just dash around a lot, set up for the ink bombs, and just look for openings. Where, okay, you may be getting chipped and dipped by these missiles, but once. Once you get a uh, rising there or something of the ilk, or just run it and grab, that works too. That's <laughs> when you start to really get a lot of value. So Exactly. You gotta kinda get in against Samus, which is a difficult task. She has that zoning and um Not only does yeah. she have the zoning, the up B, the screw attack is a bit of an issue. <laughs> And that what Inklings would like to do in situations like this is dance around your shields, press you in theirs, try and force a grab. You can't do that reliably versus Samus, because if you do that too much... Oh, beautiful down tilt from Ramboss there. <gasps> Just down tilted mid-roller uh, mid there. I didn't even care about the roller. It, like, kind of went through it. It just has the range, right? Yeah. It's just, it, you, the, the gun goes so far out that you just blast them before they even get to you. Yeah, and... Um yeah, that up B, as you were saying, like you dance around the shield, kind of pressure the shield, but that up B, just especially out of, out of shield, yeah, yeah it's, it's a very, very good but move. But breaking out, oh, it doesn't get the down air. Wonderful patience there from Rambos. Doesn't sort of mash out of it to get sort of up aired or up smashed or something. So now Rambos has a healthy lead, but mm -hmm. stage doesn't really let you just play back. You need to sort of play both ranges here. Yeah, it's difficult though, because you're qu close quarters with oh, the Samus. The Ooh. Bomb. Oh, what? That said the complete Sakurai? opposite way. Wait, no, hold, hold, hold on, hold on. I need to call HAL Laboratories. <laughs> ha HAL, yes. What was that? Excuse me? Nintendo, hello? <laughs> Where did that send the... That was not the right direction oh. we thought I was going to go. So anyway, Rambus is three stocks to one. Yeah. Have a convincing lead. Has and shown tempo advantage for most of this game. Honey is going to need to mix up something drastic if she's going to take this game, because especially if you're falling into charge shots like that, a good slap up smash is going to at least take one of them, but you still need to find two more. This is a very uphill battle for Honey, yo. Problem is, how do you approach a Samus is just throwing everything out, especially on a smaller stage? Because you know, people say about wider stages with Samus, you don't want to be close oh, to Oh, that's how you do okay. it. That is exactly how you do it. Never you mind. You don't need to build up the set. You just need to rush them down off stage. You know that Rambus is going to want to try and do that double bomb setup or however many bombs he's going to do just to secure himself s some safety. You can just get there, beat him to the punch, throw that down there, and make this okay. almost an even game. Oh, and she's got some ink on him as well. It's going to do a bit more damage. Able to get a and bit now, more ink Booyah, as well. I think this is Booyah zone. I think it's a little low, but the rate should make up for it. So now Rambos needs to play so carefully because a grab could be the kill. But yeah. A grab was in fact the kill. It's not the way around I was expecting. I was about to say, you're talking about a grab, <laughs> the grab from yeah, Inkling. You need to be careful of that, you know, a tether grab from Samus. It has such a big range and at that percent as well, that up, uh, the up throw is gonna kill. It doesn't have the frame data to back it up, but when you also have to deal with the pressure, like it's a similar animation to stuff like missile and charge shot. So like when you see that start to be like, oh, I need to hold shield. That's when it gets you. <laughs> you shouldn't hold shield, yeah. That's the problem. Uh, that's where Samus kind of catches you out. If you're holding a uh, shield too much and you're sort of not, you know, like moving around and, uh, you know, you're just uh, being playing defensively, um, with shield, you're not sort of, you know, like moving, walking, jumping. You're going to get called out a lot by it, and it's going to be devastating. Honey, if you're watching this vlog back, I just want to know, I see your ch your stage choice. I respect it greatly. What? Is, wait, did they just pick that stage no, choice? It, we, we are going to... Uh, oh, we are, uh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> the, the, the FD variant FD. of Great Game Offensive. Yeah, I was about to say it's Great Game. Yeah, because <laughs> a lot of people don't like the uh, the graphic uh, background of FD. It's, they find it distracting. Acting. This is, this is funny. Like, honestly, this is one of the better FDs in my opinion, in that it has a fairly neutral but still pretty bright background. So like, you can actually see stuff in front of it. Yeah, and the floor also isn't too distracting. 
Pet. Good choice from uh, Honeyo, who is opening up accounts with a good rapid jump skill build. Percent Ooh. tries to fish for the offstage kill again and actually gets back. Uh, this is actually really dangerous for Ramboss. But he just bullies his way back on with a forward air. Oh! That's a very nice catch, Honeyo. Just remove the platforms, make it a more linear approach. Remove the ability for Ramboss to play around, run up to him, grab him, get the booyah, get the lead. This stage might have genuinely been the play in more way than one. <laughs> But say FD is a very, very good stage uh, for Inkling. Very flat stage, you can just get a lot of uh, rollers off as well. It is pretty good though as, as well for Samus because you don't have that platform to sort of survive and get away from the charge shot. So disagree, I feel like platforms actually help zoners a lot in that you get to stand underneath them. And then what True. you have is a lot of setup where you can, oh, jab one is so scary for Samus, you don't know what the follow-up is. Yeah, but, platforms are interesting. Yeah, do you, what you really want to do is like set up yourself in a corner beneath the platform so then it becomes super hard for the opponent to approach you where if you have you can't approach them from the air as well because you can just get shocked so easily very true indeed so. as well oh who's edge guarding who here honey oh okay. all clipped by the charge shot Ooh. dash checkers and kill though Beautiful DI there, not to die quite yet. Oh, the air oh. dodge away from the charge shot, but, but everything was covered. It doesn't matter if you air dodge the charge shot, because that just puts you in range for the grab. And that means you will lose the stock, but still 100% built upon Ram Boss. Uh, I think exactly. we are about in Booyah range here. I don't actually know the percent. I'm just going off gut feeling based on how heavy Samus is. Quite bulky because of the armor, but. Charge shots again, just the wrong direction from Ramboss. The turnaround's not quite coming out for him. There's been a couple of this game that have just gone the wrong way. Yeah, it's been a bit weird sometimes. It sends him in the complete opposite direction. Okay, kind of fighting, you know, zoning with zoning here. But you can just see how scared Ramboss is, because Honeyo is dancing around in front of his shield. Just dancing around, not committing to any option, and Ramboss just stood there, releasing shield, holding shield. What do I do here? And eventually that's when Honeyo commits to an option that would actually put her in risk, but at that point, it's almost a guaranteed hit, but you just gotta watch out for those charge shots. Those aren't guaranteed, but if you're getting hit by them, they might as well be. Yeah, you gotta be careful. Hanio struggling a bit led, yep. See, Samus, really great character with her ledge trapping, and Hanio struggling a bit to get back to stage. That's twice in a row, it's been a bomb hit off of ledge. Yep, and it has been, yeah. And it's a punish, be a grab, or that time the F Exactly. Yeah, Hanio capitalizing a lot from uh, you know neutral in the middle of the stage, but Rambos just capitalizing off of the ledge trap. See, he's got her where he wants him again at the ledge. Doesn't call okay. the rolling out though. So Honey gets to live for now, but needs to take this stock something bad, because right now this damage just keeps going up and up and up and Oh, one hit of a pair. That could have been no, so much more. Okay, she gets back to stage. That was very close. That could have been game over. She has to be careful of the charge shot here once again. Ledge trapping. But a good get-up attack. Rambos gets here back. He can't punish even if you get hit by the bomb. Ooh, she's possibly... Oh, run away again! Oh, it's such a quick move, though. Even if it has so much kill potential, all the lag is pre-built up in the charge. That when you fire oh, it, it's essentially free. Pro, yeah. That was actually such a good bait from Ramboss, using the charge to just cover the grab. Ramboss will take the set to zero in a pretty convincing fashion. Yeah, that was a strong lead for uh, Honeyo there, but yeah, she couldn't, she couldn't clutch it. As I was saying, yeah, it's just Samus. You, you struggle to get back to stage with her, but as you were saying, she was covering. Uh, Rambo story was covering a lot of options with Samus. You know, she caught. Um, caught the air dodge in. He was getting those grabs, those up throws. And it's just it's just difficult because Hanio had such good advantage state in neutral on stage, mm. but she was getting pushed off too uh too often. And that's, and that's where that's yeah. where you suffer a lot.